how to use PayPal PayPal tutorial for beginners. Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. In today's video, I'm diving or giving you a complete beginner's guide to using PayPal, whether you're shopping online, sending money to friends, or using PayPal for your business. This step-by-step -step tutorial will walk you through everything you need to know on how to get started with confidence. All of the mentioned tools are going to be on the description box below, so make sure to check it out. And so first things first, let's talk about the overview of PayPal. PayPal is one of the most trusted and widely used online payments platform in the world. It lets you securely send and receive money, shop online without revealing your credit card, and even manage international transactions. PayPal has introduced some fresh UI updates, improved security, and more features, so let's dive in on how to use it properly. And so, let's start by creating your PayPal account. You can start visiting PayPal.com or downloading the PayPal application from the App Store or Google Play Store. Once inside, you then want to click on the Sign In button or the Sign Up button. You then want to choose a personal account or business account. Basically, a personal account is perfect for shopping, receiving money from friends, or small transaction. A business account is ideal for freelancers, entrepreneurs, and online sellers. Basically, with this one, we will be able to send, spend, and manage our money for the personal account, and we will be able to shop online without sharing our payment info, access exclusive rewards and cashbacks, and manage money, discover crypto, and more. For business, we get paid online, in-store, or on the go, collect donations to help our business grows. We can accept more forms of payment so you don't miss a sale on the business account. You can easily integrate with tools you like to use to run your business, and you will be able to sell securely with a brand customer's trust. In my case, I'm going to sign up with a personal account right here. First things first, you then have to enter your country or region. And right after, we will then be asked for our email address. You will then be able to create a password and fill in the basic information like your name, address, and phone number. Then you have to verify your email and phone to activate your PayPal account. And so, right after, we then have to link our bank, credit cards, or wallet into our PayPal account right here. Now, by doing this, this lets you fund transactions and withdraw money. Now, to link a bank account, you can just navigate through the dashboard right here. And simply, once inside, click on the Add Card or Bank option. Now, after clicking on this option, it will then take us to this page where we can then choose to link a credit card or link a bank account into our PayPal account. Now to link a bank, you then have to just go through the button right here. And right after that, we then have to enter our account information for PayPal. So for example, we have the bank name, the bank code, account number, and your name right here. Now if you want to go ahead and simply use your credit card, you can just go ahead and do so. Once again, click on the Add Card or Bank, click on Link a Credit Card, and from here, we will be able to enter our credit card by typing in the card number, expiration, and CVV. Now, PayPal might send a small test charge to confirm the card or bank. Once verified, you're basically good to go. Now, how can you simply send and receive money? Now, to send money, you want to click on the Send button right here. You then have to enter the recipient's email or phone number. Right after that, you then have to choose the amount, currency, and reasons. For example, you have goods slash services or family or friends. You then have to add a message if you'd like, then click on confirm through the transaction option. Now, to receive money, you just have to give someone your PayPal email. When someone sends funds, you'll get a notification and the money appears in your PayPal balance right here. Now, how can you simply shop online with your PayPal account? Now, for example, I'm buying some products here inside 
Microsoft Game Pass. And let's just go ahead and say that I want to buy this specific item right here. You can use your PayPal on websites like eBay, Amazon, and more. But as an example, let's go ahead and click on the buy option. From here, click on next. And you then have to simply choose the PayPal option inside the websites like Xbox Game Pass, Amazon, and other shopping online websites out there. Now, you're also covered by PayPal buyer protection, which can help if your item never arrives or isn't as described. Now, how can you simply withdraw money? You just have to head over to the wallet option, click on the transfer fund. In my case, it's going to be inside the dashboard right here. And right after clicking on funds, you then have to choose your bank or link credit card to enter the amount right here. Enter the amount, click on the next button, and right after that, you then have to enter the confirm button. Now, the transfer typically takes around 1-3 to three business days, though PayPal also offers instant transfers with a small fee. Now, let's talk about the PayPal security feature. Basically, PayPal uses encryption and two-factor authentication to keep your data safe. You can enable 2FA in your settings using an authenticator app or SMS. So you just have to click on the gear icon right here. Once inside, just click on security and you have different type of security that you can go ahead and use. Once again, you want to make sure to enable the two-step verification inside your PayPal. Now, let's talk about some additional features of PayPal on using it for business. If you're running a store, freelancing or accepting donation, PayPal offers PayPal.me links for fast payments, invoicing tool, business reports and analytics, website payment buttons, and integrations with e-commerce platforms like Shopify, WooCommerce. PayPal also supports subscription billing and integrates with services like Stripe and QuickBooks. And so, let's talk about some additional tips and tricks. You want to use PayPal application for quick access on the go. You have to keep your email verified and check notifications regularly. You want to avoid using family and friends for business deals. You won't be protected. And lastly, you want to explore PayPal credit if it is available in your region. And that's it. A full tutorial on how you can use PayPal. From creating an account to sending money, shopping safely, and even running a business, PayPal remains a powerful and versatile platform. If you found this video helpful, drop a like, subscribe, and follow for more digital tools tutorials. Let me know in the comments on what you want to learn next. Thanks for watching.